the Phase 1B2 study of obinutuzumab, ibrutinib, and venetoclax and CLL is a way to study a chemotherapy-free combination. So combination treatment in CLL in general has a very long tradition of success, including combinations with chemotherapy and anti-CD20 monoclonal antibodies, leading to just very high rates of durable response. However, the side effects of chemotherapy are really difficult for a lot of patients, and there's also some long-term side effects. So now that we have some newer agents, the idea is to combine these three agents because they have very different mechanisms and largely non-overlapping toxicity profiles. So the dosing scheme for the study starts each agent over the first three cycles to mitigate the side effect of tumor lysis syndrome with the venetoclax. And the phase 1b portion, which was reported at this meeting last year, established the recommended phase 2 dose of venetoclax is 400 milligrams, which is the like, approved dose in CLL as a single agent. So since we had a dose that was tolerated, we moved into two cohorts that occurred as parallel phase 2 studies. And this is really the cohort of previously untreated patients.